The effects of bin Laden's death are far reaching, all the way to the airport police at Spokane International. KXLY 4's Jeff Humphrey live at the airport today, where police now have some serious new firepower. Yeah, Robin, for the first time in the airport police department's history, officers here are now carrying AR-15 assault rifles. They are not fully automatic machine guns, but still capable of stopping a problem very quickly. The new guns made their first appearance at the airport less than 24 hours after Osama bin Laden was killed. Police were already in the process of beefing up their firepower, and coincidentally, their AR-15 program was just certified on Monday. We felt it was a prudent measure to protect the traveling public and our employees to make sure we have all the tools at our disposal. And as the worlds evolve, we need to evolve as well. The 30-round AR-15 gives airport police a long-range weapon, and unlike their pistols, fires a bullet capable of penetrating windshields and stopping drivers. Bin Laden's death has prompted security changes at Spokane International as well. You know, one of the things that the public's going to recognize the most is we've increased uh, police presence on inbound and outbound airport drive. You'll see more uniform presence in the terminal, in the parking facilities, along the curb. This bomb sniffing dog has been working behind the scenes of the airport for about a year now, but today was the first time we've seen him here in the passenger terminal. The canine's presence seemed to put travelers at ease. I think it's a great idea. You can never be too careful and it makes me feel a lot safer. Oh, no, I think it's, it's good. I think everything they're doing is great and I hope they continue to uh, keep up the good work. On the other side of the airport, security forces are guarding Fairchild air tankers. Crews are rebuilding the base's runway and so the planes have taken up temporary quarters at Spokane International and in Moses Lake. And keeping those tankers safe is important because one of them is Fairchild's alert aircraft. That particular jet being kept ready to launch at a moment's notice in the event that it's needed to refuel the fighters that are protecting the West Coast from another hijacked plane. Reporting live at Spokane International, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.